He's the acting superintendent of the eighth largest school district in the country. And tonight, Jeff Eakin says he wants the job permanently. Now at 6, ABC Action News reporter Carson Chambers is outside school district headquarters with the latest on this. Carson. Well, Jeff Aiken tells me that 25 years with the school district has led him down this path to be sitting right here as acting superintendent. Still, it is very likely that there will be a nationwide search to fill the job. I am. I, I'm very interested in the position. Acting Superintendent Jeff Eakins is clear he's going for it, though maybe it's a little awkward. He's sitting listening to the school board talk about launching a nationwide search to fill the job he wants. Not strange. I understand the nature of what the, the business of the board is right now. The search comes after the controversial firing of Superintendent Mary Ellen Elia in January without cause. A contract the county will pay $1 million to sever. Elia was making $440,000 in salary and benefits. So I think in order to maintain some credibility um, with the community, I think that we have to really do a national search in order for that. So I think that it's really important that we do a national search, open it up, and again, if we hire from within, then I will have the utmost confidence that we've looked at the best there is to offer. The district plans to hire a headhunting firm spending between twenty-five and forty thousand dollars, and they'll want to hear from you too. The community input will also um, happen um, once we hire a firm uh, to be able to to help us with that process. The super search is supposed to wrap up June 30th, a deadline that's quickly approaching. I think that it can be done. It's going to be tight, though. I think it's going to be really tight. Even Eakins agrees a national search is the best route, though he's hopeful it'll lead back to him. I'm not going to shy away from the fact that I, I feel like I have um, a, a vision. And we could hear by mid-March whether or not they have that consulting firm who's going to process this whole search. Live in Tampa, I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News.